Hello, dear friends, and welcome. Today, I'm really excited to be participating in the Blooming Tablescape Hop with these amazing YouTube creators that you see here. The hosts of this hop are Lini's World, Coffee with Nadia, and one of my very first YouTube mentors, Glam Queen of DIY. I'm linking their channels in my description box. As part of this hop, I'm asking that after watching my video, you click on the link of the next video in this hop, which you'll find in my description box and also pinned in the comments section. Please hop over and watch everyone's beautiful blooming tablescape. Did I mention that there's a 100 US dollar giveaway? All you have to do is watch each of the 10 videos in this hop and comment on each one, letting us know what you liked best about our tablescapes. Your name will then be entered for the giveaway. And now, enough talking, let's get to this spring blooming tablescape. Let's step into my dining room where I will be setting our spring blooming tablescape. So here I've started with our basics of a beige runner down the middle and then the wood chargers at the four place settings in the middle. And then at either end of the table, I've added these green placemats that look nice and springy. It's a great green sort of celery color, which is lovely for spring. And then I've placed these round green chargers on top of the green placemats and white square dinner plates at each place setting on the table. And then what I've done is I've taken these green cloth napkins. I ironed them so that they had a nice crisp formal look to them. And I wrapped them around our dinner plates. Now here is the first floral I'm adding to my blooming tablescape. These, I believe, are bloomed tulips, and there is a flower that looks very similar to tulips, and I often wonder if that's the flower that these are. Um, if you know for certain, please let me know in the comments. I would love to know if these actually are tulips or not. I believe they are. And I did purchase these just a few short years back when I was having some ladies over for a luncheon, I believe, and I was so happy when I found these. I think they're so pretty. So there's one at each place setting. And then the other florals I've added is these colorful stems down the center of the table, beautiful white Easter lilies, which I absolutely love for spring. We have this bright orange flower and then these yellow flowers. The yellow flowers might be called freesias. I'm not sure. Uh, please don't laugh at me. I am definitely not a floral expert. Um, but I sort of learn as I go. So if you know the names of the, some of these flowers, please do let me know. I have placed atop the stems this pretty moss-covered basket, and I did use this basket for my Easter kitchen decorating this past Easter, and I think it's quite appropriate for our blooming tablescape because I'm adding these, or have added these, two potted flowers that I purchased. I literally today ran to my grocery store and I wanted to find flowers that were similar to the color of the flowers in my luncheon plates there. And these were the closest that I got and they were the last two. 
and so they fit beautifully inside the basket I've added this pretty sparkly butterfly I love butterflies and in the center coming out of the basket is this pretty orange floral stem and that's it there and the beauty about these two potted flowers that I bought is that this Mother's Day weekend I will be taking one to my mother for Mother's Day and the other one to my mother-in-law and I do hope that they enjoy them. And that's what our center of the table looks like. And then just to finish off the table, I've added some wine glasses, of course, and some simple cutlery. And that's our table. What do you think?